could ever get to spend enough time together. Lisa's getting her doctorate in, in Munich, and Lauren's a venture capitalist in Hong Kong, and uh, I'm right here. <laughs> you know, Carolyn, I think I could worship the ground you walk on if only you lived in a nicer neighborhood. <laughs> I guess I'm not an uptown type of girl. Had enough of that growing up in Greenwich. But, uh, you know, the crack dealers, the drunks, this area has its charms. <laughs> anyway, I had a great time tonight. Me too. I, I know this is short notice, but there's, uh, there's this thing. There's a benefit tomorrow night for the Robin Hood Foundation. I'm sort of on the board. It's really great. Anyway, I was thinking that you and I could... Oh, gee, I'm sorry, but I sort of had plans already. But, uh, thanks. Can you get out of them? Uh, don't worry about it. Um, wh what about this weekend? I'm sort of leaving tomorrow for the rest of the weekend. Oh. I'm sorry. Uh, I've never, um, I don't, I don't know. Uh, should I be calling you? <laughs> I'd love to see you. I'm just trying to be up front about everything. That, that you've got your own life. I got that. <laughs> but I'll be back Sunday night. Call me, okay? Well, she's not anybody. Really? That, that's not what I meant. Uh -huh. Carolyn works for Calvin Klein. She helps out the celebrity clientele. Mm -hmm. And she's funny. <laughs> Michael, you're going to love her. She's, she's got this amazing energy and this life. Oh, she sounds great. Trouble is, I'm not the only guy she's seeing. <laughs> you have competition. Well, welcome to Human Race, John. Well, all I know is I cannot stop thinking about Well, you have her. to, okay? You stop. You just forget about Carolyn. You, you think about George. George, my friend.